Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just doing a simple bronzy look, so we're gonna get straight to it. Grabbing an M511 brush from Morphe, I am going into my Morphe 35N eyeshadow palette. Gonna grab this shade here for my transition. I've already primed my eyelids with some concealer while I was doing my brows. That way my eyeshadow will stay all day. Next, grabbing an M514 brush, getting that mauve taupey brownie color. I'm just going to apply it on the outer corner of my eyes. And this is a very simple look, so I'm not going to go too far up. And this brush, I'm not sure which one it is. I will link it down below. Grabbing that dark plum color, I'm just going to go and create um, like a little crease. This way it's going to create some dimension in my eye. Then I'm going to go ahead and blend it out with the brush that we used previously. Not grabbing any extra product, just going to blend. And next I'm just going to trim my lashes before I actually apply some glue on. And then curl. Before I actually add my lashes, I'm just going to add some black eyeliner to tight line my eyes. That way my lashes will look more full. And these lashes are just some dollar lashes from Daiso. I'm um, not sure which ones they are, but you could add any lash you want for this look. And sorry I'm not in frame here. Wait for it to dry. And then add to the other side. Okay, now I'm just going to grab the NYX Wonder Pencil and add that to the bottom waterline. This is going to make me look more awake. And then grabbing a flat definer brush, I'm just going to use that same dark plum color to kind of smoke out the bottom line a bit. Then with the pencil brush, I'm just going to blend that out with that transition color. Then apply some mascara. And then I'm going to go ahead and apply some lip liner. This is Pale Pink by NYX Cosmetics. I thought I was recording like my foundation and highlighting contour, but it didn't record. But I already have a video on that, so I'll link that down below for you guys. And um, this lip liner was actually a little too light for me so I ended up changing it after and I went for a darker look but you can pair it with any look you want the eyes are super simple so you can use dark or light and this is just some lip gloss from Revlon I believe again I didn't like it so I just changed it up Next, I'm just going to spray some MAC Fix Plus to give myself some moisture and then set my makeup with the Scandinavia Bridal Spray. And that's it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video.